All right, next one. Here we got today is Sailor Jupiter. Really different change in color now. They all come with a good amount of um, pieces, you know, to interchange them with, with hands and the faces. Which is really nice, you know, having a good variety of stuff like that. Just makes them a bit more fun to mess with and repose and stuff like that. And I know some people really aren't too crazy about that kind of stuff, but, you know, every now and then when I get bored or I have time and I clean out the case, you know, dust everything, I really do like to go through and um, I'll move them around and mess them around until I get a good pose or, or I'll try something different or, you know, make them do a different, you know, style or something just to see how it is. Oh, I forgot about this. The other one was kind of stuck in the back, but here's a quick look at the little instruction and full um, list of everything that it comes with. It is in English, which is really nice. But I mean, some of these are really self-explanatory just because, uh, you know, they have pictures. Warning delicate. Oh, there's an antenna. I know she had an antenna. Um, here is their... Hmm. The bases, which I freaking do, I really do enjoy their bases. I think they did a heck of a good job on that. Each girl has their own customized base, which is super cool. I wish more more companies would do that more often. Um, makes it easy to figure out who belongs to what. Okay, let's go do it. So much tape again. I think this one and the last one have less tape, though. And of course, I try to save all the packaging and everything with mine. Oh, yeah, this is what they were talking about. I didn't know she had an antenna. I do not remember that at all. But they were saying that was really fragile. Looks good, though. For whatever the heck it is, it looks funny coming out of her hair like that. Okay, here we go. I joined in the back as well. Oh, her, I didn't even know. I didn't even realize she had different shoes. I thought she had boots like the rest of them. Yeah, she does. Again, it's it's been a really long time since I've seen it. I, I mostly just watched the first season when I was a kid. I don't really don't remember too much from it. But I really do like the color. This color green really is. It's really nice. And then she has, he has a joint for her hair. An actual ball joint with a hinge, it looks like. Yeah, so you can really get some good angles on it. And then not to mention her, uh, her little, um, what's it called? Hair clip, not hair clip, hair tie. Also has nice paint to it as well. Elbows, everything's painted. This still has the same glossiness. And she has a nice little crisscross and a bow tie. You know, bow in the back. Nice matte as well. So, so overall, she looks super good too. She comes with... Another three, I think, I think just but all of them come with three, uh, three faces, face plates, three face plates, and she comes with, I think, the most hands at all of them. She's really cool. Come on. I think are their eyes. Is she the one with different colored eyes? She might have different colored eyes. I'm not sure. I have a hard time. My colors. There we go. Next one. Happy face. I like how this one looks. I think those eyes are green. They'd probably be a little bit more stand out, but more on the figure, of course. <laughs> that, one, that one actually is pretty cool too. A little angry, kind of pouty look to it. Let's get a closer look at some of these hands. Oh, these are hard to get out. Dun, 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 dun. Really, I mean, really well sculpted. I mean, they don't have to put this much detail. It's so tiny. I mean, so hard to see. I got a piece of lint already. It would be really hard to, you know, not too many people are going to get this close to it. But to know that there's, you know, the creasing and then the, the fingers actually are different proportions and different sizes. To make, I mean, there's a, there's a little bit of a seam line. I mean, it's pretty noticeable. But it looks good, though. You know, for... For details that you really don't, you're going to get, like I said, nobody's going to get this close to them and, like, stare at them for this long. 
they look good overall and so yeah she doesn't have as much stuff she just mostly has a whole lot of hands to change off and then this antenna that i didn't even know that they they had at all which that looks really interesting <laughs> i wonder how that's gonna look like when i put it on her um you know i'll try to put it on try to put it on right now let me and i know one technique you can use is the whole hot water or warm water and let it dunk pretty much dunk her head in the water and, and it'll soften up some of these i'm not used to them because the figma ones come off so easily this is kind of scared i'm gonna break up there we go put this on real quick come on oh yeah that's a super bad spot to put it to have that in there we go now she gets that 5g but uh yeah it still looks really good um but yeah i can really see how easy that is to pop off especially since some of the figures that i'm used to having i'll put a whole lot of force sometimes there we go easy peasy all right so that's all i got for for today and we're getting two more two more steps and then we'll have them all open so that's all i got for today so thanks for watching